Welcome to our channel where we bring you the latest and greatest in the world of Skyrim modding. With the vast selection of mods available, it can be overwhelming to decide which ones to choose. That's why we've put together a list of the top 9 Skyrim mods that you simply can't miss in May 2023. From game-changing magic enhancements to immersive gameplay additions, we've got you covered. So, without further ado, let's dive into our top picks. Are you tired of having to physically approach NPCs to interact with them in Skyrim? Look no further! The Remote Interactions mod allows you to communicate with friendly and enemy NPCs from afar, adding a new layer of immersion to your gameplay experience. The mod Remote Interactions allows you to interact with friendly and enemy NPCs from afar in a variety of ways. With friendly NPCs, you can shout their name if you're having trouble finding them, ask a nearby NPC to come to you, or have a conversation with them at a reasonable distance. This is perfect for giving orders to followers from afar, talking to NPCs that are normally unreachable while you're sitting, or having a conversation while on horseback. With enemy NPCs, you can taunt them during combat, surrender to guards even when sheathing your weapon no longer works, intimidate them into fleeing away, or provoke them into entering combat. The mod features a hotkey that enables interacting with NPCs at a distance, and it's completely plug and play, compatible with everything, ESL flagged, and has no requirements. There are no extra menus or search bars, and all interactions are UX friendly and in vanilla style. Different interactions are available based on context and the type of actor you're interacting with, and distance and line of sight also play a factor in the type of interactions you can have. The Remote Interactions mod offers a new way to engage with NPCs in Skyrim, both friendly and foe. Whether you want to taunt enemies during combat or converse with followers from afar, this mod is a must-have for any Skyrim player. Install the mod today and take your gameplay experience to the next level. In this time, we're taking a look at the latest magic mod by Kitty Tail Stormcalling Magic 2. As a follow-up to the first Stormcalling Magic mod released nine months ago, this mod takes lightning magic to a whole new level. Stormcalling Magic 2 adds two new astonishing spells that showcase the true power of lightning. The mod recreates some of the Sorcerer active abilities from Elder Scrolls Online, bringing five new and stunning magic skills with their unique effects. The new spells include Mage Fury, which calls on a bolt of lightning to strike an enemy, making it perfect for TDM's target lock system. Then there's Streak, which transforms you into a stream of lightning and flashes you forward while leaving a trail of lightning in your wake. This Storm Energy spell creates a 40 damage shock of energy and electrifies everything in its path. And the Maelstrom spell calls down an unstable cloud of lightning to attack enemies. This lightning cloud will quickly subdue any enemies that stand in your way. This incredible magic will make your magic more dynamic and give you a higher level of experience. One of the best things about Stormcalling Magic 2 is how you can obtain these spells. Once you reach level 75 in Destruction, these powerful spells will start to appear randomly in loot and magic merchant inventories. If you're looking to upgrade your Markarth experience, we've got just the mod for you. It's called Alti Markarth's Forge, and it's a simple yet effective upgrade to the game's forge in Markarth. What does it do? Well, it makes the forge great again, of course. But in all seriousness, this mod changes the roof mesh of the forge to a new one, giving it a fresh and updated look. But that's not all. With this mod, the smoke from the forge can now exit through the window, rather than through the roof. This adds a touch of realism to the game, and makes the forge look and feel more authentic. There's even a version B for Golden Dwemer Pipeworks Redone, so you can customize your game even further. The best part? There's no ESP, which means it's safe to install and uninstall at any time. If you're tired of the same old forge in Markarth and want to spice things up a bit, be sure to check out ALT Markarth's Forge. Do you love hunting in Skyrim, but feel like it's not as immersive as it could be? Well, look no further! This mod dynamically fixes the prices of pelts, hides, meats, and rewards for hunting gameplay. You can now roleplay as a professional hunter! Let's talk about the animals first. Wolves are now level 8, which makes them much more dangerous, especially when in packs. Bears, including the cave and snow variants, have a smoother difficulty curve, while saber cats have a little more health to make them more challenging. 
Mammoths will now flee once their health is low, making them act more like real beasts. Frostbite spiders have also been buffed to make the transition from one-hit kills to boss fights less jarring. Now let's talk about the items. Hunting is now a more profitable activity than ever before. No longer will you wonder how hunters in Skyrim can afford to buy their arrows. Animal skins and furs have had their prices increased across the board. As a bonus, the mod also increases the prices of leather, leather strips, and all hide and leather armor pieces to maintain a balanced economy. Similarly, the prices of all stews, soups, and cooked meals made from these meats have also been increased. Next up, we will be introducing a new mod that replaces all of Falkreath's architecture with highly detailed models and 4K textures. However, this mod is not about aesthetics. It also includes an arena where you can fight and earn septums while visiting towns. And the best part? There are no loading screens or lag. Everything works smoothly and naturally. And with over 100 patches included at release, you don't have to choose between mods and other existing mods. Additionally, more quests and functional buildings are incorporated into the overhaul to add to the village feel. Next up, we're talking about a mod that's sure to set your gaming experience on fire. I'm excited to introduce you to Volcano, a carefully crafted magic mod that's perfectly balanced with vanilla spells. As the name suggests, Volcano is a fire-focused magic spell pack that includes spells in three categories, Destruction, Alteration, and Conjuration. In the Destruction category, you'll find spells that allow you to unleash devastating fire base attacks, from ashes to lava, and even walls of flames. But that's not all. One of the exceptional features of Volcano is its unique effect that has a chance to cover enemies in ashes, effectively damage them. This game-changing ability can turn the tides of a battle in your favor, providing you with a strategic advantage over your foes. Volcano also offers a spell that enhances your weapon attacks with fire damage. However, be prepared for the trade-off as these spells reduce your attack speed by 25%. It's also worth mentioning that heavy attacks have a damage boost, making the spell more effective when using two-handed weapons. And for all you summoners out there, Volcano lets you summon powerful Molten Worm, Molten Astronaut, and Molten Monarch companions to fight by your side for a solid 60 seconds. These loyal companions will come in handy as they are actually quite reliable in combat. In this time, we're going to talk about Stronghold's Largishbur, a mod that will take your Orc Stronghold experience to the next level. With Stronghold's Largishbur, you can expect to see enhanced textures, improved architecture, and a more realistic and immersive feel to the Orc Stronghold. The exterior of Largishbur has been completely overhauled, giving it a fresh and improved look that truly does justice to the Orcs and their culture. While many mods focus on enhancing the exteriors of main cities and towns, this mod has taken it upon himself to revamp the exterior of the Orc Stronghold. Creator's dedication to the project is evident in the level of detail and quality of the overall mod, making it a must-have for any Skyrim player looking to elevate their Orc Stronghold experience. Next up, I want to introduce you to a mod that is sure to add some new flavor to your game. It's called Northern Farmhouses. What sets this mod apart is its unique combination of meshes from the well-known cities of the North Dawnstar mod and Falkreath with vanilla farmhouses. This combination gives the farmhouses a fresh new look and a northern theme vibe, which is perfect for those of you who want to change things up visually. However, it's important to note that this mod is intended to be used in conjunction with the Cities of the North series, as this will ensure that your Skyrim experience is cohesive and that the northern-themed farmhouses will fit in seamlessly with their surroundings. It's also recommended to use a retexture mod along with this one, as the mod may look out of place with vanilla textures. Lastly, we'll be taking a look at Redbag's Rorikstead mod. This mod takes inspiration from Nordic themes and architecture and completely overhauls the interior and exterior of Rorikstead. This mod utilizes custom textures and assets to accomplish this historic appearance, delivering a unique aesthetic that I haven't seen attempted by any other mod. As with the exteriors, the interiors have also been built from the ground up and have equally fitting appearances to match the outside. They have a minimalistic yet satisfying look that is a clear improvement over vanilla. In addition to the new homes, walls have been erected around the town, and there are two new guard towers in place. Redbag's Rorikstead mod is a fantastic addition to any Skyrim playthrough. 
If you're looking for something new and unique to explore, then definitely give this mod a try. And there you have it, our top 9 picks for Skyrim mods in May 2023. Whether you're a seasoned player or just starting out, these mods are sure to enhance your gameplay experience and make your adventures in Skyrim even more memorable. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more Skyrim content, and let us know in the comments which mods you're excited to try out. Thanks for watching. See you next time.